So I'm gonna start explaining about 6.12 expert system. Specifically on section C, describe how an expert system is used to suggest diagnosis. First, how does it work? An expert system is made out of three parts. A user interface. This is the system that allows a non-expert user to ask or type a question to the expert system and to receive advice. This is why it is made as simple and easy to use as possible. The non-expert user should know how to and understand how to use it, which is why it's made simple and easy. So they don't need to ask someone who is expert in using the system or technical in using the system to help them. A knowledge base. This is a collection of facts and rules. Basically, it's a database and all the information in it is provided by human experts. For example, all the symptoms of diseases are compiled by ex other experts such as other expert doctors and professors. An inference engine. It acts rather like a search engine, so the non-expert user types the information and they will match it up with the question. So how does expert system suggest diagnosis? They are used by doctors and nurses so they can diagnose the patient correctly. It makes it easier to find problems linked to the symptoms type and also to recommend correct medication. All of the information inside the expert system are made by other experts. They compiled all their information and knowledge. The advantages of using expert systems to suggest diagnosis are it makes it easier for the doctors and nurses to find information rather than just typing it in the normal internet search engine. Not all of the information can be accurate. It also takes a longer time to call someone who is an expert in these finding these symptoms and diseases. It can also recommend correct medication so they can so they don't use the correct medication to the patient. It is also already available to them rather than just calling and asking somebody else. The disadvantages are it can easily adapt to new circumstances and it can be difficult to use. The doctors and nurses need time and training to actually use the expert system. They have no common sense because a human user tends to notice obvious errors whereas a computer wouldn't because the computer are just programmed to do something so they can't do another thing. Since we humans have brains we can decide we can make decisions more accurately in a more creative way in a more ver various way rather than computers. Thank you.